Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Sprout. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I am having a fantastic day, and in today's episode, I want to do some more stuff with Astral Sorcery. So, last episode, we kind of did the basic stuff from Astral Sorcery. We took a look at uh, the first chapter up here, which is Discovery, and we kind of did... Uh, pretty much all of this stuff to kind of get started with the mod. Today, I want to dive a little bit further into exploration and some of the things that are a little bit farther into the mod. So I want to make the Starlight Crafting Altar, and I also want to make the Spectral Relay. This is all stuff that uh, I think will be fairly important for us. So uh, let's start with the... Let's start with the Spectral Relay, I guess. Um, and we have our crafting altar right here. I think we will have everything we need. Uh, let's see. We need a marble pillar. We need some wood planks. And, of course, I didn't actually bring any wood with me because I'm an idiot. Um, <laughs> that's all right. We'll just get some right here. No big deal. Um, okay. Problem solved. So, let's see. If we go... Uh, I need to look at the recipe because it's not JEI integrated, but we need marble pillar, which is chiseled marble. Here we go, marble pillar. So we'll put that here, put planks there, and then I think it was a glass pane and a couple of gold nuggets. No? Oh, I need a glass lens. Okay, that's easy. So, glass lens, like so, and then we need one of these aquamarines. There we go. Uh, and then if I remember correctly, you right-click on it with the resonating wand, and it does the beamy light thing, and there we go. Okay, awesome. So, we got our lens. And now, gold nuggets, plank, plank, pillar... No? Uh, why, why you no work? D d can it not be marble pillars? Maybe I was looking at the wrong thing. Okay, let's just use regular marble, I guess. Uh, boop, there we go. So that will make the, whatchamacallit, the spectral relay. And apparently this is used to like boost the power of your, um, your astral altar, or whatever it's called, the the starlight crafting altar, this thing, uh, which is the next thing that we're going to make. So uh, here we need a rock crystal, a liquid starlight bucket. So let's grab one of each of those, and we'll go uh, there and here. Speaking of starlight, I should probably put this here and start getting some more, even if it's going to fill up extremely slowly. And then we need marble pillar... Chiseled marble, marble pillar. Okay, so we've got chiseled marble right here. And we do that, and that, and that does not do the thing. Chiseled marble, chiseled marble, rock crystal, liquid starlight. May only be, uh, okay, so basically this has to be done at night it appears looks like this will not work during the day so that's probably why we're having an issue i'm going to assume so i'm going to wait for it to become night and i'll be back with you in just a minute all right guys i am back and you will notice it is uh it, it, it's not night yet i know i said i'd be back when it was night but i, I was thinking about this this uh altar thing is actually like a multi-block structure so we need to make this multi-block and I figured, why don't we make the multi-block right now while we worry about everything else, um, you know, in a little bit? So, yeah, that's that's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, we need a crafting table, and then we also need some coal and some marble. There we go. So, let's go ahead... Uh, let's make maybe half a stack of sooty marble like so. And then let's see if we can get this multi-block kind of figured out. So, 
Um, I think I'm just going to build it like right next to this for the time being. And it looks like this thing is, uh, it is becoming night now. I don't know if it's technically night yet, but we'll see. Also, let's double check this. Rock crystal, liquid starlight bucket, right? Liquid starlight bucket, rock crystal. Yep. Does the rock crystal have to be anything in particular? Doesn't say so. So hopefully this will work. And it will actually do the thing. This is what I'm hoping, at least. Uh, maybe it just needs to be later at... Oh, it, it, there, there that goes. <laughs> you, you make me more starlight. Liquid starlight stuff. Okay, so this does not appear to be working. And it is definitely night now. So why are you not making me the altar? Marble pillar, marble pillar. Chiseled marble, chiseled marble. Marble pillar, marble pillar, right? Yeah, that is exactly what all of these are. So, oh, there we go. It. Uh, I guess it just had to, I just had to be more patient. Okay, so let's right click this. And that should make us the starlight altar. It'll take a minute. Beams of light coming down from the sky. Quite lovely. Also, it appears that uh, this blue for the starlight locations uh, only works. Oh, it makes it, it upgrades the existing altar or the, ex the existing crafting table. Ah, I see. See, but okay so and it's bigger it's bigger so i can't put it right here anymore i get it gotcha also there was a note in the chat your vision expands you learned more about attunement so now i have a new chapter for lack of a better word um in astral sorcery and now there's all this stuff that we can learn about there is a bug in astral sorcery that we're gonna have to deal with uh in a little bit but first let's finish getting this uh crafting altar thing made so let's go back to exploration and right here starlight crafting altar we need to make a multi-block like this apparently um i don't know. Okay, so you can like rotate it. Gotcha. Okay, so this is, uh, and actually one cool thing about this mod, if you hover your mouse over this little star, it'll tell you all the things that you actually need. So we know we need a bunch of marble arches. Those are right here. So let's just start with that. This is going to be our center, I think. So let's tear all ah rip okay well that's fine let's tear all of this out for now and i want this in my left hand so that i can make sure who come back you that this is still located in a a blue spot right so we need to make like a four and then a space and a four and then a space and a four? Is this right? No, it's a five, like, in the middle. Okay, so... It's a three block gap here, right? So we have essentially, like, a three by three. And then on each of these corners of the three by three, we make it into a four, like that. And then the altar goes right here. Although it almost looks... Yeah, this is totally full. It's fine. It's it's good like that. Okay. Yep, got it. All right, so then we take our marble bricks. And it looks like those kind of surround... Oh, ghost block. Must have been. There we go. And then this kind of surrounds like so, right? And then chiseled 
marble in the corners, which is this one. So boop, 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 and boop, like that. And then around those edges, we go with the marble arch. So like this. Boop, 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 boop. And there we go. And then I think it was, uh, that's regular marble. Where are my marble pillars? I guess I put them back in here. Yeah, there we go. So then we go take the pillars and we go what, too high? And then it chiseled on top? Yes. So, pillars like so. And like so. And a chiseled on top. And that should now... Yes, there we go. Okay, and this bar is no longer red. It is now blue as we want it to be. Awesome. Okay, so now I think what we're going to do... Let's go maybe over this way a little bit, and let's make like a, well, I'd really like this to be centered, but I want it to still be in the the blue, right? This like, yeah, there we go. This is going to be a much better spot. Okay, so we'll put that right here. Let's make sure that didn't mess up our multi-block. It did not. This is good. And then I'm going to put this guy back. And we'll put our thing in and let that start filling up. And then I think our spectral relay, if I read this properly, this basically just needs to go near the altar. A small setup dedicated to collecting starlight for the altar near should help solve the problem. Clearly this is blah. Yeah, so basically you need to make another multi-block that, uh, that is for this so if we look at that we need chiseled and then the marble arches so um here here marble arch marble arch marble arch here here arch and a sooty marble in the middle and then the spectral relay goes here and then i think you shift right click and shift right click maybe Or maybe, maybe we need to take that out of our hand. Maybe not. Or maybe it doesn't have to be bound? When the relay has been placed high up but close to an altar, it will collect and focus starlight once a glass lens is placed inside of it. Oh. So do I have to make another glass lens? Is that the, th the thing that needs to happen? Because that's easy enough. Let's try that. So we're gonna go boop, 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 and like so. And then we'll do that. And the starlight's actually going down, probably because it's starting to get later. Oh, wow. Where'd you come from? I don't know what that was from, but I think I can put this in here. Yeah, and then you can see the particles kind of going towards this to like focus the starlight a little bit more. That's really cool. When the race in uh, huh? Starlight is then redirected as small sparks to the closest nearby altar. Yeah, so these these are coming over and into this altar to kind of boost its uh its power or whatever you wanna call it. It says don't use too many though because they'll uh it won't work very well. Okay, cool. Then there's also this this uh hand telescope thing, which I think is something else we should try, but... Oh, I thought that was a witch for a second. It was, it was this breaking. Got it. I, uh, I'm losing my mind, guys. I'm straight up losing my mind. That's all right. Um, you do not have silk touch. Do I have silk touch on any of my tools whatsoever? Uh, fortune, efficiency, I don't think I do. I really need to get a silk touch something. Um, but we need more, um, glass panes. At least a couple of them. 
So let's figure out which way is home from here. I think it's actually the opposite direction of where I was going. Let's just look at our map. Northeast, not southeast, northeast. Got it. All right, we'll run home real quick and grab some more glass panes. Now, as I mentioned earlier, there is actually a bug in Astral Sorcery. And that bug is due to one of the mods. I'm not sure which one. But it, essentially what it does is it prevents you from being able to place down iron ore. So, like, I'm, I'm right-clicking right now. And you can't actually place iron ore. That, that's a problem because in Astral Sorcery, you need to actually put iron ore into the world so that you can do stuff with it. Uh, which we will get into momentarily. Uh, let's grab some glass and let's just... Oh, that's the return. Let's just do something like that. Make some glass panes. Okay, cool. That should allow us to make the hand telescope. And we need sticks, a gold ingot, and some planks. Easy enough. Let's make sure we have a gold ingot to take with us and then also since we're about to get into some of the other stuff up here in attunement let's take a look at this so here's the iron uh, there's some stuff here that we need we need a crystal lens logs iron rune mar okay that's all easy enough we can do that and then we need a linking tool again looks like we can do that just fine as well and then it gets into iron transmutation, right? So basically what you have to do is put iron in the world. And I'll show you that in a minute. And it's not, pla it's not possible to place iron in the world. So somebody in the comments had a brilliant idea and said, use a mechanical miner or a, um, a mechanical user from uh, Extra Utilities. And I was like, that is a brilliant idea. So now if we put this guy down and we say place block and I grab the iron ore, we can do this and bam, it will place it in the world for us. So it's, I mean, it's not ideal. <laughs> But it's a workaround that actually works. So whoever it was who suggested that, thank you. I really appreciate it. That's a brilliant idea to overcome uh, what was honestly going to be a pretty nasty challenge. I, I, I think I mentioned it in, uh, I think it was the Vanilla Plus update, uh, or the Vanilla Plus mod pack update video that I did uh, yesterday, I think. Um, but anyway, whoever suggested that, I appreciate it. Great idea. Uh, so that'll be the way that we kind of work around the bug with iron. But first, let's go ahead and make uh, some of this other stuff that we need. So first of all, we want to make the hand telescope right here. So we need a glass lens again. That's easy. We know how to do that. Oop, doop, doop, doop. And like so. And actually, I think we needed uh, like a couple of these. So let's just make like three of them right off the bat and let's see if I can actually make three of them at once or I have to or if I have to do them individually okay that actually made all three brilliant so then we put our glass lens here we put a gold ingot there we need some planks and some sticks so the sticks go there and like so Right? Yes. Doesn't say it has to be done at night. Uh, is it just regular? No, it's a glass lens. Gold ingot. Planks. Hmm. Maybe I don't have enough starlight coming into the altar? That is conceivable, at least. Also, we can... Not quite enough liquid starlight. I was hoping. 
I mean, it said it needed an above average amount, but I don't know how much starlight is actually in here. Starlight crafting altar average, luminous crafting table above average. And right now we're less than half, so maybe average is considered like right here. Maybe that's what's going on. Okay, so in that case, let's try to make something different. Uh, I do want to get to the point where we can do this stuff during the day and we don't have to do it all at night. Uh, and I know that is something that you can do in this mod eventually once you get far enough into it. Oh, here we go. So let's try. Oh, and, I, and maybe what we should do is we just maybe we should just skip straight to the. Wow. OK, maybe we should just skip straight to the regular telescope because the telescope. Oh, actually, I need to make the hand telescope to make the, the, the regular telescope. So never mind. That's fine. Linking tool. I think that's going to be the same problem. And this one is also good. This is all stuff that we can't make until it's night. Dang it. <laughs> it's killing me. That's all right. Um, <coughs> excuse me. So maybe... Maybe if we made another one of these guys... It said don't use too many, but I think maybe if we could use like two of them. Or, or maybe what we should try. Let's take that lens out and just see. Does that lower this? It's right here now. If I put that lens back in... Eh, it doesn't seem to affect it at all. Maybe it has to be closer? Let's just try something here. I'm... And, you know... I apologize if this appears a little derpy. This is the first time I've ever played around with this mod, so um, I'm learning it. Or we're learning it together, which I think, honestly, is part of the fun. Like, I've never done that before, so, um, you know, we're experiencing the joys of astral sorcery for the first time together, and I think that's kind of a cool thing. Let's try moving this closer. Doesn't seem like it really did anything anything at all <laughs> hmm well I really don't want to have to wait for it to be night again but I may not have a uh, an alternative method of doing so hmm Problem is moving in. Then again, high up but close to the altar. Maybe what could happen? Here's a question: What if we take this whole thing right here? Right. We'll take our lens out. So, give me that back, please. What if we tried doing essentially the same thing, but we built it up way in the sky? I don't know if this will work or not, but we're going to try. So, let's just build this up even higher, right? We'll go up to, like, here. What are, what are we at now, right now? 163? Keep going. We're going to go up until we can't go up anymore. We're going to go all the way up to Y level. Well, probably not all the way up to Y level 256. But we're going to go up quite a ways. 220. 240. There we go. So Y level 240. Uh, although, you know what? That's going to block... No, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay, so then we want to go Marble Arch, right? Chiseled, Arch, Chiseled, Arch, Chiseled, Arch, Chiseled, City Marble, put that guy down here, put a lens in it. It ap 
appears to be doing things. I see the sparks. That's a good sign. And then let's just kind of work our way down. And let's see if that changed the, uh, the amount of starlight in our altar thing here. Because I, it, from reading the book, it kind of seems like you want to put the, the little redirector way up there in the sky and then have the altar down below. That's kind of what it seems like anyway. We'll see. So if I come to here... Oh, yeah, this thing now has tons of uh, starlight, but it's also getting night. So I don't know if that was because we put the lens up there <laughs> or because it's just becoming night. Um, either way, it's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and make the hand telescope. So we'll make that guy. And that will allow us to look at the stars, I believe. Yeah. We can, like, look up and look at stars, but right now we don't really know where to find any of the constellations, and it might actually not be light enough yet. So, that's fine. But that's apparently uh, a telescope that you can use to look at stuff, which is kind of cool. Uh, all right, back to attunement. Here we go. So now we get into the, the more advanced stuff. Let's go ahead and make the telescope right away. So, this will go here. Put gold ingots there and there. Plank here. Sticks there. Bam. Make me the actual telescope now. That'll take a minute. Of course. But. We should be able to like put this guy down. And we can kind of, like, go through this. And then you can see there's, like, puzzles, right? So, um, we'll, uh, some of these brighter stars, like, this is essentially a puzzle. We'll, we'll get into that later. Um, anyway, I want to, I want to get this stuff that I want, I need crafted, uh, done before it becomes day again and we can't make it anymore. So, let's go ahead and make the crystal lens. We need three glass lenses for this. And then the linking tool does not need one. So let's do the linking tool first. Uh, and I believe it was plank? Or not? Do I not have uh, actual logs? I got some dark wood. Ah, that'll work. So here, here. And then we need a rock crystal. Which I should have in here? Yo, where did all my rock crystals go? I had a whole bunch of them. My rock crystals have disappeared. Did I? I didn't use them all. There's no way. I had like three of them. Did they all get used? Maybe they did. Hold on. Let's see. The stuff we have made. The hand telescope doesn't need one. So we didn't use one for that. The spectral relay doesn't need one. So we didn't use... Th so where did I put all my rock crystals? What? Ah, it was because I had a... Ah, I do that all the time. <laughs> ah, good job, self. Okay. There we go. So we'll, let's make the linking tool. It's... So, yeah, if you're using one of these storage module tablets and you can't find a thing that you're pretty sure is in here, make sure you don't have something written in the search bar. I do that way, way too often. Anyway, I digress. There we go. So then we need one more of the lenses. And we'll make one of those. And then it should just be a matter of making the crystal lens right here. And that is three lenses like that. Those go here. We need a gold ingot there. We need a rock crystal here. Two logs. And two ruined marble like so. And then we do that. And that should be what we need 
to kind of continue. I also need one of these focus starlights, but I think that's actually something you use the uh, the crystal lens for. Um, and then basically, we're going to end up making uh, star metal, which is like a special ore that you use for all sorts of cool stuff. So I'm very much looking forward to that. Unfortunately, though, guys, I am out of time for this episode. So I think I am going to have to call this one right here. My friends, if you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Links in the description below. So check that out as well. Other than that, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.